On August 14, 2023, the Polish Ministry of Defense announced via Twitter a landmark agreement with the South Korean defense sector. This collaboration aims to design a cutting-edge armored infantry fighting vehicle, IFV, leveraging the chassis of the renowned K9 155mm self-propelled howitzer sighting information released by the Polish Ministry of Defense. The new tracked armored infantry fighting vehicle based on the tracked chassis of the K9 155mm self-propelled howitzer fitted with a ZSSW remote-controlled turret system. The ZSSW-30 turret emerged from an R&D, research and development, initiative led by HSW, bolstered by support from WB Electronics. Initially, this turret system is slated for installation on the upcoming Rosomac APC, armored personnel carrier, vehicles. Equipped with a 30mm Bushmaster MK44-S gun, the turret is capable of firing ABM ammunition and can be upgraded to a 40mm caliber. Additionally, it boasts a coaxial 7. 62mm machine gun and a dual spike ATGM, anti-tank guided missile, launcher. Enhancing its capabilities further, the turret integrates an advanced fire control system with auto tracking and dual optronic systems, catering to both the gunner and the commander, offering a hunter-killer slash killer-killer solution. The K9 chassis was also used by the Polish defense industry to develop and design the Crab, a 155mm tracked self-propelled howitzer. Using the K-9 Howitzer's chassis as a foundation for developing an infantry fighting vehicle, IFV, offers several notable advantages. Firstly, the K-9 Howitzer has a proven track record, having been exported to multiple countries and subjected to real-world combat situations. Its established reliability and durability would provide a solid starting point for an IFV. Moreover, by using a shared chassis for both artillery and IFVs, military forces can benefit from a commonality of parts. This streamlining could make logistics, maintenance, and training more efficient and consistent. The K9's inherent design provides a robust level of armor protection, which would naturally benefit the infantry housed within. Furthermore, the powerful engine of the K9, originally intended to swiftly transport heavy artillery, might offer enhanced mobility to the IFV variant, making it swift on the battlefield. Lastly, from a fiscal standpoint, leveraging an existing platform for a new vehicle design could result in significant cost savings, as foundational research and development expenses have already been incurred. The ZSSW-30 is a cutting-edge, remotely controlled turret developed by the Polish company Huda Stoloa Wala HSW, for modern armored combat vehicles. Its centerpiece is a powerful 30mm auto cannon, supplemented by a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. Additionally, the turret boasts an integrated system of spike anti-tank guided missiles, empowering it to tackle even heavily armored enemy threats, including tanks. One of the standout features of the ZSSW-30 is its remote operation capability, allowing vehicle crews to manipulate its functions from the safety and comfort of the vehicle's interior, greatly minimizing their exposure to external threats. The turret is further enhanced with state-of-the-art sensors and optics, ensuring optimal operational efficiency during day and night, as well as under diverse weather conditions. Notably, the ZSSW-30 is adaptable and has been primed for integration onto various platforms, including the Borsic Infantry Fighting Vehicle, Another innovative product by HSW, conceptualized to replace Poland's aging BMP-1 IFVs. Furthermore, the protective design philosophy behind the ZSSW-30 is evident in its robust armor, safeguarding against small arms fire and shell fragments, with provisions for additional modular armor based on specific mission needs. This development underscores the prevailing direction in contemporary armored warfare, which emphasizes the amalgamation of protection, situational awareness, and formidable firepower, all while ensuring crew safety.